Well, hello, and here today on the Rusty Glove Box, what we're going to do today is we're going to work on our Wimpire generator. This is an old project that we're going to revisit, and I'm going to be doing some updates to it. So y'all come over here to the workbench, and let's check it out. Well, this is the new configuration. I'll put up a, a little clip of the old configuration. But this is old piece that I had made, and this is the old piece that I would made, but I had kind of reconfigured it. And uh, the back part where the tail is, this is from an original wind generator from the 1930s, a uh, wind charger. Me seeing this uh, slip ring is what kind of inspired me to revisit my old wind generator. Uh, I like how this is able to spin without twisting your wires up. And that was a big deal on having a wind generator mounted on a pole. And the way I accomplished that the first time is that I made a brush set up and uh, it worked pretty good but after a time after a year or two it actually wore through my copper brush right there and so I was gonna have to kind of redesign this I had bought a kit a different set of windings and a uh, permanent magnet armature and that's why they call these PMA permanent magnet alternators uh, the windings are much finer uh, no brushes no capacitor anything like that and the only reason why the uh, bridge rectifier is still in there is so I'll have a terminal block that I can come off with the uh, AC voltage. Well here's what it looks like uh, with the alternator or the PMA installed and this is the way the uh, slip ring is going to attach. I don't like how long these screws are, so I'll be getting some shorter screws. Uh, this wire is UV rated wire, but I am going to try to put this plastic sleeve over this wire, and we'll see how that goes. So anyway, that's our progress today on the uh, wind jet. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, we kind of got a good start on rebuilding the wind generator. Uh, probably the next time we see it, we may be digging a hole and setting a pole. So anyway, I do appreciate y'all coming by the shop. This is Rusty Glove Box, and I'm out.